will testing our water uh, that we drink. It is important uh, that the water we drink in the vessel is safe. It's required for the company that we test our drinking water every now and then. The standard testing we do is every one month we test the drinking water. It is our portable water test kit. All right. So even we are sending our water to shore facility every six months, we need to test for our own safety our water that's being drink and being used in the galley uh, need to be test for every one month. So what to do? We're going to test for the coliform and e coliform that was uh, on the water. But first we will use this uh, sachet bag. We will get sample water. Oh, this one is used. This one is used. Oh, this one. Okay. So the equipment they're going to use is the incubator. The incubator. Okay. And then the Coliform test set. So what inside is the sachet of uh, Collier 18? This will be used for testing to check for the coliform. Okay. And we will have the UV, the UV lamp for testing. Next. We will be using the sachet. So we will get one sachet sample. It's already have tablet inside. So it's there. It's there. We will take sample of drinking water here in the engine room. So what we're gonna do is uh, open this one. Okay. So it's important not to contaminate the water. So uh, it is required to have your your hands with gloves and everything for safety. So we will take sample on our drinking water in, in the engine room. We will take 100 ml. Okay, follow me. It's important to put the coliform. So we put on the special jar first, special bottle, to have a to stay there. Now we will get the collier tablet. In this one we will mix. Okay. 
and then put on the water. So, we're just like a chemist here. So what to do with the with this one? Just carefully turn it there to close. Then lock it with this one because it's uh, they have uh, like a wire inside to fix it there. Then you can uh, mix it. Okay, so once the tablet and the collier 18 dissolved, we will put it again on this bottle, the plastic bottle. manual according to the manual once you complete the tablet the salt and the other the coliform it turns yellow automatically your water have coliform or e coli but now you see it's not yellow what to do here to do next is put it on the container Tight it here. So what we're going to do is incubate this water for 24 hours at 35 degrees Celsius. So we have the incubator here, as we said a while ago. This is how to use. We open it. And the setting temperature should be 35. Okay, so once you already set the temperature, what you're going to do is put the sample container there, put it there, close, and let it stay for 24 hours. So here, it was posted here, please do not unplug the power until 24 hours we are currently testing E. coli and, and, and coliform so this is to remind that everyone that this machine should not be switched off okay after 24 hours we will show you how it looks like if the water that we test have coliform or E. coli so that's it at the moment after 24 hours we will check back again Check on our water sample. Okay, we're back. Uh, since we already been uh, accomplished the 24 hours incubation period, we will check how the water looks like. This is the water sample. So it seems good because it's still the same color that we when we put it's not become yellowish so in this uh, test we show that our drinking water inside the engine room are safe to drink and all of the connection that uh, will be going up for consumption of drinking water is also safe but nowadays since the sailor is a uh, become uh, addicted to drink mineral water so most of the guys are just drinking the mineral water but until uh, but still our water is safe to drink because we already test it we've been testing it for, for every month every month so the final check we have to check it with the UV ray 
So we have to go in a darker room to check if this have coliform. Okay, so we will go to that room. Okay, so we will switch off the light and come inside. The problem is you will not fully see the video. So, okay. So this is how it tests. You cannot see any blue color, any particles inside the water that we test. So it is clearly uh, recognized that the drinking water we use on board are safe to drink. It is safe to drink. We don't have any coliform or E. coli form on our drinking water okay okay so once again we have just completed the testing of our drinking water on board we are very lucky and happy that our test has become positive and it's good to show you how the complete test of our drinking water and work carried out. Thanks for watching! Please like our video and don't forget to subscribe to keep you notified to our latest video.